separated. You <laughs> got uh, stuck in the uh, barrage of cameras. It's no wonder Botox wouldn't let Angelina Jolie leave until they got a shot of her custom-made Atelier Versace. And now we show how you can get a nearly identical gown for much less. We took a bridal dress by Maury Lee by Madeline Gardner, added the red piece to it to give us that red feel, and look at the beautiful detailing. This dress, $815 as compared to $80,000. The Angelina dress was very slit in the leg. This dress is a little bit less revealing. You could see that when you walk, it swishes. I'm wearing that coat. While at the Pierre Hotel in New York City, Kathleen de Manchy shows us an exquisite alternative to Reese Witherspoon's corseted creation. Our interpretation of the dress also has that sexy sweetheart neck and all of the ruching and detailing. The mermaid skirt is really definitely one of the very big looks of the season. This one from Angelina Facenda Bridesmaids is only $179, so quite amazing. $25,000 or $179. I'm wearing Kabali. And while Kate Beckinsale's dress had a square neckline, this sweetheart style is just as flattering. It is about the fit and the whole glamour of all this embroidery and wonderful detailing. This is an heirloom piece, a dress by Roberta Cavalli, $80,000. This dress by Blue Bridal is only $899. What really caught my eye, 300 carats by Lorraine Schwartz. Kate's jewelry was worth nearly $1 million, but you can shine just as bright with replicas by Kenneth J. Lane starting at $150. And great news, guys. There's still time to play E's Red Carpet Pose Off presented by Sprint. Just go to eonline.com forward slash pose off to place your vote for the best dressed celeb at the Globe.